everybody, it's Roy from ANS Gear. We're gonna look at another accessory for your Molly or modular systems today. This is a grenade pouch from NXE. It's part of their extraction series. Um, they call this one the frag. We'll go ahead and pop it off the backing here and pull it out. So the backside is going to be, uh, you're gonna run it through your Molly system. You're not really gonna weave it. It's a little stiff for doing a true weave. So you're gonna run it through, just make sure you go through all the weave that you can and snap it together at the bottom. As far as what's on the front, it's got a Velcro flip for the front. It's gonna open up, so you're gonna store whatever you can inside here. Now they call this a grenade pouch, so it is, in, typically you're gonna see grenades in it. Um, but for me, I always like to see what else I can put into things because, um, the more stuff or the more options you have for your accessories, the more prepared you're gonna be. And if you need this for a radio maybe, or you need it for something other than a grenade, it's good to have it on there. Now at the bottom of this one, inside here, you can kind of see it right there. It might be a little hard to see, but it has an elastic strap underneath it. And it kind of runs kind of like in a U shape underneath here. So that when you push something down into it, it stretches out that elastic. And when you would open up the top, it's gonna to help push that piece up and out. Now that's gonna work really nice for something that is round at the bottom, maybe a paint grenade. But if you're gonna to wanna to put something else inside there, it might not work so well. So something like this can work pretty nicely. It's gonna help pop it up like that. That's nice. But for something else, well, actually you could probably do it with a radio comm. Now it slips off of there. Seeing as though the Velcro or the uh, uh, elastic is only a thin piece of elastic inside there, it, it is possible for things to slide off of it so that the elastic is kind of under the side of it and not underneath it. And that could happen with a grenade as well. So uh, if you plan on using the elastic inside there, make sure you set it up completely underneath there. But for something else, I wouldn't really worry about it too much. Just push it down in there, fold it over. Not a big deal to just reach in there and grab it and pull it out. I mean, it's plenty wide to fit all sorts of sized objects inside there. You saw that we put the uh, little 50 round pod inside there. So gonna hold it. Gonna put the radio comm inside there. It's gonna hold it. So it's definitely a very wide pouch and fit all sorts of stuff inside there. The elastic piece down in the bottom, yeah. I don't know if that's really worth being in there, but it's there. If you don't like it, you could just cut it out. So check this out. This is uh, the frag pouch from, from NXE. It's actually not called a frag pouch. It's a grenade pouch that they call the frag. Um, part of their extraction series is available in other colors. So check the website for availability and order yours now through ansgear.com.